Nestor, Danny, today was the latest oath of office ceremony for ASO, but a man not wearing a badge in light of this recent case was also honored. You may recall the news about the horrible crash, a teen trying to board a school bus and was critically injured. Some are saying the quick action of one Gainesville resident may have saved the teenager's life. I react. You need help, I help you. That is Jonathan Madero's new philosophy. Some know Madero's as an active member of the U.S. Army, but now others in Alachua County are calling him a hero for a different reason. The accident caused a semi to jackknife and the southbound lanes were completely blocked. As deputies and FSTs assisted the Florida Highway Patrol in directing traffic and investigating the scene, a citizen stopped and rendered aid. Mr. Madero's, can you come up? Medeiros received the Citizens Coin of Excellence from ACSO today for helping a teen injured in a crash involving a school bus and a semi-truck last month. After issuing medical assistance at the scene, Medeiros rushed to the hospital and was greeted by a surprising reaction from the teen. He uh, wouldn't respond to the doctor's name. I mean, they would talk to him. His stepfather, his father, and his mother wouldn't respond to him. And when I went to him and said, hey, Dylan, old boy's eyes popped open like he knew me for years. While the teen is still in recovery, the crash continues to impact the lives of all of those involved, including the driver of the semi, Alfredo Garcia. Garcia recently pled not guilty to a charge of careless driving and has a hearing set for September 7th. But no matter what happens with the case, Medeiros plans to stay in touch with the teen's family. I was like... You let me know if she has my cell phone number, my address. I was like, if you need anything, I was like, I'll bring out soda if the kid needs soda. I was like, if you want to make a dinner, I'll make you dinner. I didn't really care. Whatever they needed. Now, Madero says he has stayed in contact with the family since the incident, and the teen seems to be recovering quite quickly.